Yo, what's up everyone? Awesome Alex TV here back with another awesome video and so today I'm going to show you how you can edit like Flea's 60 pinking. So Flea's 60 pinking is a well edited video and I was wondering if you guys would want to know how to edit a video like that. So you might say how can you teach us that video you didn't edit that Flea did. But here's a video that I edited my montage. So you can take a look if this is what you want to edit like then please stick around and you will learn it. So I'm not gonna put like my face cam because it will like cover up some space of the Premiere software so it doesn't distract you guys huh? So let's begin with the tutorial. So there will be a Google Drive link in the description down below. You just wanna click on it and here are the pro project files located over there. We just need to drag and drop. So these are, oh, these are over here because I want you guys to like test them out because I know most of you guys can't just go and get some clips and if but if you want us to learn you you have these clips to just try out your edits on so here is the there will be the Google Drive link in the description down below first of all how to record a cinematic like this it's pretty simple the game in which you get the clip you just what you want to do is you just want to go and record the replay of that file of that game so once you do that what you want to do is go back to the replay and then you want to just take your controller or you can even use your mouse and you need to just pause the shot right there and then you want to do like a free drone and then the drone speed should be like 0 0.25 or 0 0.01 either like a, a slow speed but it should be like manageable and then you need to just record like a circle doesn't the circle does not need to be perfect and it does not need to be like a perfect speed or like slow or fast because we everything we will be doing is over here so don't worry so first of all we need to see which part we need to start it from i think this is perfect and then end it right so and this end is in good enough so once we do this this is our cinematic clip now what we need to do is we need to get the clip 
so what you want to do is first of all remove the audio because we will be adding that later because when we're doing the speed stuff the audio really gets messed up so we don't want to work with the audio right now so also remove this audio as well so let's get our clip so here is the clip which we are gonna edit and put the effects on so what over here then we need to locate where the thing will pause so the cinematic comes in so you need to go frame by frame and then after the edit I think so when yeah over here I think let's put it like right here okay so we need to just cut this out put this first and then put the cinematic on and then this so this is our basic done now the thing is we need to now go into the speed ramping stuff so what's that let me show you you right click on the FX thing go to time remapping speed and you have to do it for every clip over here you want to press alt alter and then you need to move your mouse wheel up so that it gets big then what you want to do is you want to get the flow so right now if I play it the cinematic is choppy and then who's gonna like wait five hours for this thing to go so we need to make like smooth like this and then somewhat like that and we need to make it like cinematic okay you get me let's do it right now we need to move this further so if we like make this thing like slower so that we have space for it to like extend so what we'll do over here is right over here we'll put a keyframe right over here by clicking this and then what we want to do is make this like so like 700 I, I would prefer so that the cinematic is like smooth and it's not choppy and then you need to like pull this so that it's smooth and then you need to drag this thing so it remains smooth so once that's done you wanna bring in your cinematic file and what I prefer is you do a constant from here to like the part this skin comes in like here what you want to do is go back to your FX control keyframe this part and then I would prefer like 3000 for this slow amount of clip because the clip is very slow 3000 is very good let's play it and it looks good put a keyframe over here so this needs to be slow and then 3000 if in between if you don't understand anything please feel free to ask the question in the comments so that I can help you out then what you want to do is before the kill like before he sh shoots a shotgun like over here I will say it perfect make this 700 and I would say this is perfect so right now if you play this it will be like choppy you, you you'll be saying why is this happening so what you want to do is go to sequence render once that's done you can now see it's a green line instead of a yellow one and then look at this and it's smooth as we want it to see now we need to add the audio effects to enhance this so 
all the effects will be available in the pack down below so don't worry guys and you can use the, those audio effects in your own videos as well first of all we'll add the shotgun shot unlink this remove the f thing and then you need to add the shotgun shot as soon as the name pops on this part we need to add this in so it syncs properly and it sounds perfect then to make it much better we, we can add bass add five and this is like a rough sound we want like a little bit slow so let's add a 75 percent speed so that this cool type of sound comes in this looks perfect now we want to add new item adjustment layer for the flash effect you, you go over here and on over here you want to search luminary color luminary color you want to put this over here you want to go to basic correction and over here exposure just press this thing okay one status done you want to press four over here then move two frames behind make this zero then then move two forward and then seven in front of the middle frame and make this zero so it will give us this effect you see so now we we need to add a cinematic black bars to this thing so now let's go ahead new item and then black video we want to add one over here and one on top we want to make it the shape of this this video file hide one press this and then adjust it so that it it looks like a black bar You can adjust it by moving these things, this one, around. So it looks perfect now. And it looks good. So now we need to add the whoosh effect, like whoosh and then whoosh. So what that will also be in the drive link. So feel free to use that. I'll import that pretty quick. So I added that in and now it's over here so you want to just make this so that it is on it is below this part and then you want to add one more so it's below this so now let's see let's see this perfect and now we want to add the music so we'll add the same music as flea that all will also be in the back down below Feel free to use it and right over here let's hear the audio things up so how do you want to see that as soon as you hear the bass drop you want to sing that up with the gunshot so the bass drop is on this marker to add a marker you just press M on your keyboard and then our gunshot is over here so what you want to do is bring this right here still not like sing properly now it's synced so look at this and let's now render it Oh. 
and that is probably it how to get that flow and how do you get this part done and it's that simple so all the files i used for this tutorial will be in the description down below in the drive folder feel free to use it it's absolutely free so you guys can test it out and you can also edit like flea and it's easy for you to edit with those clips because if you don't have clips and then you are tired to make it you can you have something to like practice these things on and you can like make great montages out so give this video 50 likes and then we i will show you how to get that text animation in the start and then i'll you can just do the eagle effect which is this one and how you can do the sword effect there are many effects that we put into this video in this montage so feel free to give this video a thumbs up 50 likes and we'll do a part two so hope you enjoyed this video on to the outro so i hope you enjoyed today's video this was part one if we can get this video to 50 likes we will do a part two in which i will show you other effects on how to edit the montage i showed the first part in which it was a zoom it was a cinematic transition to the kill how to have flow in the clips and then the voice effects so i hope this helped you out if you find any part difficult please let me know in the comments below i will be much more helpful to help you guys out if you're stuck so other than that being said my name is ali you're watching document tv see you tomorrow peace <laughs>